India and the United Kingdom are bound by strong ties of history and culture. India's multifaceted bilateral relationship with the UK has grown even stronger after Narendra Modi came to power. This friendship has been recognized by UK as Bob Blackman said that the British government regards India as a strong friend and ally. Lauding Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi, Blackman said that India has transformed remarkably under Modi's leadership and that it is carving its path to becoming the leading economy of the world. He said that both India and the UK have an agreement on security, defence and other matters and added that this shows that both nations showcase goodwill between the two countries. He also hailed the democracy of India and noted it as being the biggest democracy in the world. He called the BJP a natural ally of the Conservative Party. He said, As far as I am concerned, I have been a supporter of overseas friends of BJP for a very long time. The Conservative Party in the United Kingdom and BJP over here, it is that friendship, that support we value. Blackman is also seeking opportunities of doing free trade deals with India in order to enhance trade ties between the two nations. He also recalled the time when Narendra Modi was the Chief Minister of Gujarat, stating that as the Chief Minister of the state, he made it a powerhouse of the economy in India. Talking about the BBC documentary made on Modi, India, the Modi question, he termed it as a propaganda video, adding that it is a disgraceful piece of shoddy journalism. Obviously, the so-called documentary, which is more of a propaganda uh, video, if you like, uh, in a two-part series, was an absolutely disgraceful piece of uh, shoddy journalism uh, with an attack on uh, Narendra Modi, uh, both in his time as Chief Minister of Gujarat and then uh, in his time as Prime Minister. Um, complete, um, completely full of innuendo and slurs. It was should never have been broadcast by the BBC. Notably, Supreme Court gave the verdict that all allegations against Modi stand absolved as there is no evidence to support the same. Speaking about the recent survey conducted at BBC India offices by the Income Tax Department, he said that the broadcaster should follow the rules and regulations. He added that he regrets the release of the documentary and he feels that BBC is on an agenda to disharmonize India-UK's relationship. It was, should never have been broadcast by the BBC. Um, and of course, because the BBC has a worldwide reputation, people think, oh my goodness, this must be true. Um, but it was uh, produced by an external organization, overseen by the BBC, um, and then broadcast as the truth. Well. It's far from Bob Blackman has been a Conservative Member of Parliament for Harrow East since 2010. Prior to this, he was a councillor for the Preston Ward in Brent for 24 years and served as a leader of the Brent Conservatives.